So Indian team is doing really well at the Asian Games and uh, our squash uh, team has added one more gold medal into the medal tally and uh, I am joined by Deepika and Harry Bhai. And, uh, Deepika, uh, you know, it was a tough comeback for you but you have made it. How was the experience? Oh, it's very humbling. I think I'm very, very um, happy. I'm very proud of the fact that um, I took the decision to come back. I think it's not been an easy decision but I'm very proud of the fact that, you know, I kept going at it every day, putting in the hard work, and I knew that regardless of the medals coming in, it was just satisfaction that I was, you know, was coming in. And very, very happy to be part of the team again, being with um, all the team members again. I've really missed it for the last four years, so it's it's really nice, yes. Was there any, you know, um, any, any point of time, was that in your mind, you know, uh, that I won't be able to come back and do well for my nation during your, you know, uh, uh, at the time of your pregnancy and after that? Yeah, I think the first few months were the hardest. I think it's, um, you know, because naturally being so fit because I was on the tour for a very long time, for me to have taken that break and then try to come back was the hardest. I think the first few months were really hard. I remember calling Sora, calling my husband and crying, saying, I don't know if I want to do this or can I do it? But I'm just very happy and very uh, proud of the fact that I just stayed put with my plans and you know just trusted the whole process um, I, I keep telling Harry even if he didn't win a medal today I think we can be proud of the fact that we've put in the hard work and we've we've had um, an unbelievable time uh, trying to trying to win a medal I think that's it's it's end of the day it's about the process and I think we've really really um, worked hard and we're just very very happy to have converted into a gold managed to speak with DK or, or to the kid yeah, I haven't spoken to the kids yet because they were still in school, but um, I think everyone were in different rooms at home. I don't think Dinesh watched, my sister didn't watch, my best friend didn't watch, my mom didn't watch. They were all in different rooms and they were just waiting for that one message to come through. So I think he's very, very happy, yes. Well, uh, Harry Bai, uh, it's, your, it's your second medal here at the Asian Games. So first of all, take us through the journey. Yeah, the journey has been very long. <laughs> like it, it clearly showed uh, at 9-3, 9-4. You know, all the all the thoughts, all all my all the hardships that I had faced uh, come right in front of your eyes. So when I was just hoping, I don't I don't uh, get that thought ever in today's match. But sometimes you can't help your mind. You know, all the things come forward and. Uh, yeah, I just, I was just, I'm just very glad and happy that she noticed that something was wrong, getting troubling me in the mind. So she came right there. Although it took us a very long time, from 9-3, 9-4, took, took I think a matter of five to ten minutes for for me to settle down again. And basically, I was able to settle because she was right there. She was right there backing me. Her hand was right on my back. She kept calming me down. She kept putting me back on track. And yeah, I'm glad I could. Uh, yeah, we both could uh, win it for the country. So we have uh, we have bronze medal, we have got gold medal, and Saurav, I think I'm sure that he's also going to make it. Uh, if you have to assess the performance of this uh, squash team, what would it be? Uh, I think, uh, I, uh, I mean, I, <laughs> I mean, I think yeah, yeah. I mean, I think everyone everyone has done well, and uh, us boys winning the gold, and you know, girls uh, did quite well in their respective teams as well. I we were just hoping you know girls could also be with us at the podium on the, at the top of the podium. But you know, after after getting that medal, all the girls were right there behind us, sitting with us, you know, cheering as if they they are they are playing themselves on court. So that uh, that gave us the boys the momentum and the motivation to you know win that gold medal. So we are very thankful to the girls coming coming out you know rearing and supporting us cheering cheering for us and hopefully our team captain Saurav you know we are all behind him again uh, the battle is not yet over so he is still rearing to go and we are just behind him and hopefully he comes out at number one anyone anyone can answer uh, this question in, in the both in, uh, I just wanted to understand uh, and your thoughts since uh, this is our best ever performance in Asian Games you know so what exactly is triggering our athlete you know to do well uh, if you if you want to compare uh, 2018 Jakarta uh, Asian Games to, to China uh, Asian Games, uh, I think it's just the learnings that you that you uh, get after every after every win or every, every loss. So we learn quite a lot. We gain a lot of experience. Like our our team, both men and women, they have players who are very experienced. Like in the women's, there's Joshna, there's Deepika who have been guiding the youngsters. There's Tanvi and Anahat. You know they guided them really well. And obviously for me, she guided me very well. So even even the men's, you know, they are guiding us. And even for us, sort of that is there. He has been 
the men's uh, uh, the face of men's squash for a very long time so we us boys try to uh, mirror mirror him his performances mirror him you know do well so that you know he he has done so much for us so how much how much we can back him uh, in in the team events and even in the individuals how much we can how, how much ever we can stay behind him and you know make sure that he does very well as well would you like to add your thoughts and i asked my question you know keeping in mind the overall performance of our team no i see you know uh, I think it's a positive thing to take forward. I mean, we've obviously won way more medals than what we did in Jakarta, but I think one thing that we have to realize is we can't be satisfied with what we've got. I think we are a nation of billions, and I think we're um, we can do a lot more than what we're doing. So I think going forward, I think yes, I think we we should be proud of the fact that we've gone one higher than what we did in Jakarta, but. I feel like an as an athlete as a government as a country I think we can never be satisfied with what we have we have to start start working and working and hopefully we can you know get into the top 2 in the medal tally I think that should be the goal next going